Hi there, my name is Kai, and today I'm doing a review on General Magmar's Siege Machine of Doom. Incredibly long name. The character, it comes with three characters and three Nexo powers. Um, this is Clay's, I, I don't, I forgot what they call these. I think it's like Robo Horses. Um, but you can attach the shield and sword. Basically, it's a small vehicle for Clay to battle this. Here's Joe Magmar in the back. How long did it take you to build that? Uh, I don't know, like maybe an hour. I don't know. How long? I think maybe an hour. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Here's Flame in the front, um, Joe Magmar in the back, and if you look right here, I have the Book of Monsters right here. Mm -hmm. Well, not the Book of Monsters, but I forgot what it's called again. <laughs> Um, it comes with three Nexo powers. Um, this one, uh, I don't know, th I only know the names of two of them. Th this one, I don't know its name, I forgot its name. This one is Dino Mighty. And then this one is Thunder Dragon. It comes with four flat goblins. There's two right there, one right here, one right here. How does it work? Um, well, this, you push it, and then it ricochets off this so it goes high. Am I going to get shot if you do that? Yes. Then it comes with um, five of these small round ones. This is a uh, print that only one of them has. Mm-hmm. It's kind of close. Um, these are the two that... There's two of these and two of these. Um, now the weapons consist of catapults and then this, but you might think, why does it ricochet? On the box, it's straight up, so is that like a prank? No. Just push that up. Turn it sideways. Oh, yeah. And then you can see it's kind of like a mouth. And these mm -hmm. are kind of like the ears. And then um, flip this around, and, and then there's a holding cell. So if you capture Clay, you can toss him in there. Let me see him. He's in jail. Uh, yeah. Uh -huh. Um, here's his regular face, and then he has an alternate face, which is, I, I, I just don't know what to say about this. And it has 516 pieces. All put together in about like you said I think it was like one hour this is not Joe Magmar's actual weapon I modified it Do you remember how much it cost uh, like $30 what? 30 I think like $36 this is Joe Magmar's original. I think it was more like $39.99 yeah this is Joe Magmar's regular weapon but my, I modified it into a spear and why do you think that other people would like this? Well, it's just fun to play with. Plus, it has some pretty good characters. Could you make it move again? Uh, make it um, fold down? Yeah. Turn it sideways when you're doing that. You can see it okay. better. Here's Flama. Um, oh, yeah. And was that hinge hinging thing hard to get just right? Yes, Do that was again. the hardest yeah. thing. There's, um, as you can see right there, there's two of these bars, which makes this. You see, these two are facing forwards the whole time. And it kind of slants forwards, and these two push together. And I have no idea why they have this, but I think that they have this so that you can tow something, because when it's like this... Mm -hmm. Maybe that's a hand grab. What? Put your hand on to grab it. Uh, possibly, I don't know. Um, here's an overview of the characters. Here's Flama. He has a flaming sword. No alternate face, but an exclusive piece that has only appeared once before in a Lego Ultra Agents set. 
So, would you just say you're like a big Lego fan? Yes. Here. What What do you like about Legos, and especially what do you like about this particular Lego? I like, what I like about this particular Lego is the characters, plus this just looks awesome. Yeah, okay. And, and also, General Magmar has no alternate face. He has this unique hair Let piece. Let me see if I can zoom in on him. Okay, he has a unique hair piece. Um, he has his cape, and here's some back detail. Um, and uh, as you can see right here, hold he, it up. And as you can see right there, could you Be get still. him closer? Be still. Yeah, I've got the zoom. He has a um, he has a symbol of Jastro. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, also on this, it's got Jastro's flags. Now for clay, you take off this. The detail on clay is really good. I think they did a good job with the detailing, plus the metallic. Plus the metallic, if you, if the light hits it just right, it shines. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so yeah, that's all I've got to say about it. Okay. So what's your name again? Kai. Wait, one more thing. Here's a book of evil. It actually opens... Um, well, one of the books of evils, of evil, um, and then there's a little detail what monster it can release, and that's it. Goodbye. Please do subscribe and check out my other videos.